Brandon. <laughs> the love we share is a once in a lifetime kind of love. Not the once in a lifetime you find on a Hallmark card, but the kind that only real life can offer with ups, downs, doubt, and certainty. It's the kind others marvel at and wonder how we do what we do. We understand each other beyond words and we accept beyond acceptance. Our love is like our own special dance that gets perfected through our imperfections. This is pretty great for me because I'm a pretty imperfect dancer. Thank you for accepting <clears throat> the areas of my life that others don't easily accept. Not only have you been accepting of the important parts of my life and the family that I share, but you have been embracing and encouraging to building these foundations. And for that, I am forever thankful. Thank you for accepting not only me, but the pieces that come along with me. I am a lucky girl to do life with you. I promise that I will work at strengthening not only myself, but you and all that you desire. I am a fighter and not always at the right times, so I promise to pick and choose my battles. But I also promise to never stop fighting for you, for us, for this once in a lifetime extraordinary love that we share. Thank you for choosing me. As I stand here today, I want to thank you for loving me through my flaws. Though I like to think I'm near perfect, deep inside I know I am flawed to the moon and back. You accept my flaws, you point them out and challenge them as appropriate, but you accept them. And you do this even when it means taking one for the team, which is more times than not. I pray every day for patience and a slow tongue, but sometimes prayers are not answered as quickly as one would like. So thank you for always being here for me. Thank you for building me up when all I want to do is tear down, and thank you for tearing parts of me down that all I want to do is build up. Your honesty, braveness, and constant affection is not always recognized when I'm going World War III on my closet, but it's appreciated as soon as I slam the bedroom door, so thank you. Maria. <laughs> First off, I love you very much, and I'm very thankful for allowing me to be a part of your life and Nathan's life. I love our modern family. I appreciate all you've done challenging me, making me a better person, even in the places I didn't see it at first, places that I needed to be pushed. And I thank you for that. I just want you to know that through all the good, through all the bad, that I'll be there with you. That I'll walk side by side, holding your hand, through whatever may come our way. I'm looking forward to growing old with you, sitting on the porch of our house, and looking back on all the great times we shared together. You're my love of my life. And I know I wasn't easy or always quick to jump at it. Sometimes when you find the things that you're supposed to have, that you're supposed to be with, they're a little scary. So I thank you for your patience. I love you to the moon and back. I wouldn't change anything. 